And now uh, you won't drink any more after nope. this. <laughs> okay. All right. Absolutely. A Texas cowboy lay on a barroom floor, having drank so much he couldn't drink any more. So he fell asleep, and he had a dream, for he dreamt that he rolled on a hell-bound train. Well, the engine would murder his blood was damp, and the was blent by a bright stone lamp. The imp for fuel was shoveling bulbs, and the engine roared for a thousand rolls. The bile was filled with lager beer, the devil on such was engineer, and the passengers were a most motley crew, church gold lawyers, Gentiles and Jews. Rich men in broadcloths, beggars in rags, handsome young girls, and original heights. <laughs> the other end, black men, no red, brown, and white, all came together. Oh, God, what a sight. But as the train rushed on at an awful pace, the fiery fumes on the hands and face, and faster and faster the engine flew, and live louder and louder the country grew. Brighter and brighter the lightning, the lightning flashed, and hotter and hotter the air became, and the clouds were singed from each wretched riot. And all of a sudden there came a yell, Ha ha, says the old devil, you're near in hell. And now oh, how the passengers, the swift were paid, and the big the devil to stop the train. When he capered about, and he danced with glee, and he scuffed and scorned at the misery, he said, my friend, you have done my work, and the devil mayor has a payday short. You have tormented the rich, you have robbed the poor, you have turned your brothers away from your door, you have laid up gold by the cantor's front, and given ways to your beastly lust. You have mocked at justice and scorned at pride, and mocked at God in your hell-worn pride. You have paid for fair, and I'll see ye through, for it is only right you must have your do. For a laborer always expects his hire, and I land ye safe to the lake of fire, where your flesh will no roast, and the flames that soar, and my imps to pick you, for to torment you forevermore. Well, the cold we awoke for an anguish cry, clothes ringing wet, and his hair standing high, and he prayed as he never prayed till that very hour. That he would be saved from the demon power. The prayers of his vows were not in vain. For he never rode again on a hell-bound train. A hangover, ladies and gentlemen, and he joined the club. <laughs> <laughs>